Hey guys, John here. Welcome to 5-Minute Presets. This week we're in Pigments. Total surprise there. So let's go to a new preset and let's start the countdown. So let's go. I, I usually like the analogs, you know? There's just something about them. So let's see what, uh, what we come up with. I'm almost kind of feeling a Juno kind of vibe here. So let's get some pulse width modulation here. Let's put this up to the center. Bring this down just a little bit. Maybe something kind of like that. Make this free running, slow it down a little bit. Uh, should we bring another saw? I mean, technically we don't have one, but let's break the rules a little bit, right? Get some unison in here. Let's turn this down a little bit here. Okay, so let's maybe pick the Jupiter 8 filter. I guess maybe that's the closest one, I guess. Get some nice resonance on that to get a good envelope. Okay, we need some uh, release here. Okay, let's drop this down an octave here, get some meat. Okay, that's kind of cool. While we're here, we can always do our macro. So maybe let's pull this back over here and increase our macro, something kind of like that. That's all the way open. Maybe something like that. Same with our resonance here. Let's bring this down, bring this pretty significantly high. So cut off and then we'll do res here. Get a little bit of noise. Okay, so let's go to our effects here. So let's put the Course Juno 6 here, and let's go for the presets. Let's go to mode number one. Let's do the same thing for the second one. So Course Juno, where's the Course Juno 1? And then preset number one, and let's change the phase a little bit. And maybe let's bring up the drift just a little bit here. bring down the dry wet a little bit here okay so let's do a little bit of EQ here let's take out some of that mud here kind of right there not too much though Okay, so let's add some delays here, because delays are always nice here. A little bit of delay. Let's go one over eight. Now we get some reverb in here. Where is our reverb? Here we go. Let's just briefly go through some of these filters. Wow. Okay, I mean, I do love the MS-20, but man... It... Oh, okay, it's kind of hard to pick between these two. You know what, I'm just gonna go with my instincts and MS-20 because I love this one here. Kind of gives us some beef a little bit too. If I move these down here, oh, we have 47 seconds left. So what if we did a little multi-band? Ah, no, I don't like it. Okay, so we have those cutoffs. Let's do effects on number four. So boom, boom. And then we have the delay, which is here. And then we have the reverb, which is here. Dry wet 20%. Let's bring it up to 20. What do we have? 40%. Let's bring it up to 40. Then we have our chorus, you know, six, which I believe is 30 something, which is fine. 31. Here we go. Here's something like that. Bring your overall volume a little bit down. And let's label this FX here. And then, you know what? Let's, uh, 
let's attach this to macro to noise here. So let's go something like that and double click noise. <laughs> noise. Okay, so time is up. Let's see how, uh, how we got here. Let's see if we have a little drums here. Has a little bit of that vibe here. We got all our macros down over here. So pretty cool. So it's something that's also pretty fun to do as well. So let's uh, let's give a name for this here. I guess kind of Juno, because it's kind of like a Juno. Obviously not exactly, it's a different synth, but you get what I mean. So something kind of cool that I do want to bring up here. So if we go to the sequencer and turn this bad boy on, if you get this patch here, we can go from a rate from, I think one over 16 actually might be fine for this. Yeah, so all we got to do really, which is kind of cool, is bring our sustain all the way down. And kind of just play with our decay to see how we want for some really cool ARP or something like that. Let's go to our arpeggiator. Yeah, so you can do something kind of like that. So I'll put the sustain back for this patch here, maybe a little bit lower, something like that. Turn this ARP off here. And save it like this. So yeah, kind of Juno. So if you want to get kind of Juno, there's a link in the video description below. So thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.